Oh, hello everyone. This is my updated video for uh, New Year's. The new year and new decade. I want to thank everybody for watching, for your support, and everything that you do. Uh, so what I'm showing you tonight is an update on the plants I got from KJE Aquatics. I will recommend you buying plants from him. Because the plants come in great. And they grow quick. And I'm about to order some more. Because I need me? some tall ones. Mom, that for me? Yeah, for I you too, dear. One, one. Yeah, you can pick them too, dear. Uh, hey, a purple one. No, nah, they ain't got purple. But we'll get you a very nice green one. See, my daughter likes to be in the videos, which is fine with me. So, I'm going to thank everybody for watching. And I hope you liked the video. Thank you all. You have a good New Year's and a new decade. Thank you. Bye. So here's the red beta fish tank and the, the Anubis that's in here that was glued to a rock. And that's my, my daughter's fish. It flowered. So I must be doing something right in this tank. Well, stay tuned for more the other fish tanks. For, with new growth that I got from KJE Aquatics. So here in the 55, what I got from him is that big one there, the big one there, and some of these crypts. I'm going to tell you something. That guy knows how to keep plants because if you look right there, there's new growth after I put it in. These are ones I've already had, these other crypts. But these crypts here, they're doing really well. As you can see, that plant got, what, like four or five new growths on it. This one already has in the back there one growing with it. So I have to uh, let it get bigger and take it off of it. This one's re looking really good. I'm very happy with what I got from him. So... If you want plants, I will recommend KJE Aquatics. So we're going to move to the, the, the other one, two, we'll look at the other tanks I have. Alright, thank you. So here here in my my son's 20 gallon, sorry for the finger. I put these crepes in here from uh, KJE Aquatics and there there's some new growth. They're do, like I'm very surprised on how well the plants are doing. So they're doing really good in here with the Pictus catfish and this uh, dwarf grommy. I think I'm gonna have to get a couple more of them to put in this tank just to make it lively because this cat, this catfish love to hide underneath here. So I think I'm gonna bury that some more. Just. You know, just do a little more updates to the tank to make it to where the fish are out. So, I had a uh, a dwarf flash pleco in here and it ended up dying on me. I got it from from uh, Petco. It's doing well, but I think I did a mistake with putting it in here because he's catfish. I think the catfish might have got to it. So, all right, we're going to move on to the next two tanks because my son's beta tank, it, it's doing good, but there's no new growth on that Anubis. It'd be a little bit boring. So, I'm going to go to the next two tanks, and I'll see you there. So, in my 20-gallon in here, the corkscrew valve got some new growth. It's doing really well. And so do these crepes. So... Everything I got from him is doing really great. They're floating because the quarry cats uproot them. So I think what I need to do here is I'm going to add, I think I might do a mixture of sand and rocks. Just to give it volume and for the quarries to have something to sift through. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some sand. I think I'm going to go black and I'll just dump it on top after I clean it and just go with it. We'll see what happens. Because what I've learned on the 10 gallon tank that's next, the sand does really well with plants. 
So I'll see you at the 10 gallon. Thank you. So here's the 10 gallon. As you can see, there's a lot of new growth here with these crypts. Even in the back, we got a new one there, a new sprout there. And there's some new sprouts here. And even here. Yeah. His his plants are really good. What are you pointing at, dear? What's that? That one. Oh, you pointing at the snail? Hey, the other one. What? The snail? Uh, it's fine. My daughter loves being part of this. So, let's do something here. We got a 10-gallon tank. We have two Corys in here. And now I'm down to three autos. They love to hide. I need to move the autos to the big tank. And I know they'll thrive. But just, just let me know down in the comments. Just say, hey, what do you think? So here we go. We got this 10. The bait is doing really well. I love that bait. That's my my very favorite beta. I like that favorite. And that Anubis plant has some uh, new growth too. Well, a later video you will see an update on betas. So, so thank you for watching. My daughter wants you to subscribe. Say subscribe. She said subscribe. And hit that like button on the video. I kissed him. Who you kissing? I'm kissing him. Kissing who? Kiss the camera. I'm kissing the camera. Kiss it. Yeah, see, she's awesome. So, thank you all for watching. watching. If you didn't hit the subscribe or the like button, please do. Please. I would really appreciate it. Like I'm trying time. to grow this channel. This is my New Year's uh, video. Like so, thank you all for watching and Bye. dealing with what I do. All right. I'm going to talk to you all later. Bye. Goodbye.